Isle of Wight. 60 starters screamed away from cows with wide open throttles in the Daily Express International offshore powerboat race. Ahead of them were 198 miles of a gruelling test of skill and speed with Torquay as the goal. Thunderfish the third didn't make it, though there were plenty of others who managed to harness their horsepower for the full bore run along the south coast. A British entry, Trident, powered by twin Volvo engines. From America, Stern Driver, 900 horsepower pushing her along. And another British boat, Mrs. Smith. This year, new rules have allowed smaller boats to compete with the top weight 40 footers. The result's been a lot more overseas entries and really strong international competition. Big trouble for Thunderfish the third. 55 minutes out, her engine burst into flames. Driver Don Shedd and his crew had to jump for safety before she sank. But there were plenty of others to take up the running at speeds which sometimes topped 70 miles an hour. So Max Aitken's 1,000 horsepower speedbird, Gypsy Girl, was going well near the closing stages of the race, but there was no holding the team of Charles and Jimmy Gardner in Sir Fury as they stormed towards the finishing line. At Torquay, an excited crowd awaited the arrival of the winners of the seventh in the series of powerboat races. And there she was, Sir Fury, proudly taking her place in the winner's berth with the jubilant Gardner brothers, undoubted winners at an average speed of 55 miles an hour.